what's up YouTube so today I'm gonna give you a walk around on my campsite here is my overland setup I have a Homer H3 with a rooftop tent this is a trailhead I got my trash bag I got a 35 inch tires I got my 12 bolt water water source. I have an extra tent for my wife and, and kids. Uh, here you can sleep six people in there, and up here you, you can sleep two people in here, comfortable. Also, I have my solar panels over here. Currently, I'm charging my batteries. I have uh, two batteries, 12 volts, 105 amp hours each. I have a 800. I have a 800 watt power inverter. Is a 800 peak, 410 uh, sustain. I have my my 55 liter 55 liter cooler. I have my drawer system. I did it myself. You know, it's it's pretty cheap. I spend doing this myself around forty dollars. Cheap stuff. Got my two batteries in there. So you can see the voltage 12.9 I have this lighting that I use at night around the hammocks as you can see my wife right there sleeping my kids around my seats this is uh this is what they call a tailgater tailgater table pretty cool pretty convenient you can put it right there in your tire got my my fire extinguisher also here is my camp, camp my camp kitchen setup as you guys can see I got my I think this is uh, 20 20 thousand let me see yeah 10,000 10, BTUs per burner 20,000 BTUs. I got all my stuff in here. Also, here's my stuff for for cleaning. And this is my pump. As you can see, I got good pressure in there. I run the hose all the way from here, all the way to the pump. Got some extra extra water. I got here some another extra water. So this is my rig right here. 2006 Homer H3 on 35 inch tires. So this is my little setup right here in Puerto Rico. And here is Playuela, Playuela Aguadilla. It's a beautiful spot you can come here and camp do a uh, horseback riding all the way to the beach it's a pretty cool spot
all right guys so I normally get in here plugging my pump all the way up to my tank so you guys can see this is a 15 gallon I don't know if you guys see it there 15 gallon tank with my hose and then you know, it works perfectly it's 60 psi and you can adjust your pressure in here I like this sprayer a little more than the other one and as you can see the sprayer so that's my pump setup right there I bought it for two hundred and ten dollars out of I think it was a uh, Facebook Facebook marketplace uh, if I find their phone number for the person that sold me this system I'm gonna put it on the description down below